Well, how do there, chums? Chums, I was hit on up by Dutch66, and he suggested that I try out Ferrer. The Sundred Tribes. Okay. Well, we're going to give it a go. This cost me £25 in UK monies, and we're hitting play. Hopefully it's going to work with the joypad I've got here, but we'll we give it a go. There we are. Yep. OK, cool. Your jaw sense isn't supported. No, we're going to give it a go. And here we go. Yeah, allow. Sweet. OK, let's, uh, let's, let's get into this, shall we? There we go. Before the sundering, the gods once walked among us. But their power Ooh. and hubris left this world in ruins. We eke out an existence in this fractured world. But now it has become blighted with a sickness. To understand why, you, the strongest of us, have traveled here to the Cursed Valley, bringing an expedition with you. Sweet! We must find a cure for this pestilence to save our world. We must uncover its artifacts to save our way of life. Together, our people will brave the valley and unlock its secrets. Heck yes! It's like a cell shaded monster save hunter. Ourselves. Hopefully, it's better than Dauntless. I mean, I did watch a little bit of gameplay before I invested in this, and it does look like it's something I'm going to enjoy. Okay, so something to take note of here. This is very much early access, so don't expect complete seamless bug-free experience. Okay, well, characters, play games. I'll have a quick look in the options and see if everything looks okay when it comes to my um, audio. Then I'll be right back with you when I'm ready to jump right, Well, on I went it. in and I welled everything up to Ultra. <laughs> we'll see how that goes, but yeah, there we go. Well, I think we're good. Right. <clears throat> Lovely jubbly. Let's get into this. Let's hit play. I'll be right back with thee. Actually, you might want to see it, so CPT. Can I have spaces now? Of course, because if, if so, I'll go for the full freaking name. There we are. Confirm. All right. A body presets. Well, what type am I? What the fudge? Well, that, that seems to... Oh, right. So it just... Cha <laughs> it just changes the chest. Right, yeah. Brilliant. Custom shape. Yeah. Um, right. This, this is a very finicky using a joypad so i might just swap to my mouse for a moment and I'll, I'll go for all of this and i'll make my character i'm not overly impressed by the character creator at this stage people now look at the hairstyles you have got very few hairstyles uh no okay look and most of them I would say for the Ladonis. I mean, that one looks all right. But even still, I would say a lot of these hairstyles are very sort of male looking, to be honest. And the actual... Oh, okay. Okay, you can have beards. All right, fine. But I think that's the only way to make yourself look slightly manly. It says use hair colour, but that's... Oh, oh, there we go. I don't see how to change the hair. Oh, here we go. Hue. I'm going to make him look like a Super Saiyan, I think. You're too pretty! Okay, right. Angle of ears. I want big ears. And probably not that big. There we go. I do. Hat! I spent all this time making my character and cover his head up. You, you ain't got a flat cap, no? No. Well, I'll do that. Oh god, you can add necklaces and all sorts of stuff. You know what? I'm not. I'm not overly fast. Hopefully, you can get different sorts of armors in game and stuff. Um, I might. I might just tweak it to make myself my logo. Oh, jumps, I think I'm done. Create character. There we go. And into the world we go. Hopefully, people. Oh, so I want to see if this. I mean, the character customization. It's it's very basic. It's a little bit tedious with a joypad. I had to swap to mouse, but I got there in the end. Okay, right. Yeah. Wow! Well, that felt good. Yeah, that, that's not bad. And we got a heavy attack as well. Nice. 
Sweet. Mm. Dodge feels nice. You know what this feels like already? This feels very much like Power World. And that's not just because it looks like Power World, it's responsive. It acts like Power World. All right, I guess I've got to talk to this chap. You see, I don't know the Xbox controls, so this, this might take me a little while. It's not time to feast yet, All right? Why? Morning, are you hungry today? Yeah. Why don't you warm up with a hammer claw? What the fudge is a hammer claw when it's at home? Go walk to the, uh, There's some missions above my head as well, so I don't know what I'm supposed to do first. There was a pack below the island early this morning. An injured straggler behind them. Go and track it. Oh, a hammer claw is a creature, is it? All right, fine. I guess we'll go in there then. Hunt a hammer claw. Wow, we're straight in. There's jelly fish flying in the sky. Hold on. While in the air, press A. I think that's A. All right, I'm going to go with that. Let's be an A. Wee! Oh, frick heck yes! Oh, wow. Okay, well, I'm heading towards that down there then. How do I dive? Air brake is X. Uh-oh. Well, that's not something I... I... How do I dive? Whoa. Okay. We're on the ground. Okay. What's all this? Hammer claw leftovers. We'll have that then. Sweet. I can hear it. Oh, is that a hammer claw? No, he's a he's a feather hide. Maybe I Oh, budge! Mate! Don't you even try it! Freaking have you! You want some? Never hide! Suck! Stell away! Take that! Yeah, you want some? Budge that! Yeah, mate! It's freaking me! Oh, I've just realised. The sound is extremely loud. One second, people. Right, chums, I think we're good. Hiya! Take that. You died. Alright. I died trying to do all the audio controls. I'll do a better job of audio. One second. Okay, chums, well, we're back in. I don't know. How, how do I dismiss that freaking thing over there? Because I'm pressing... Oh, tab. All right, there we go. That gives me a bit more real estate, doesn't it? All right, well, let's let's jump back down, and we're going to go look for a hammer claw this time, rather than taking on that feather creature or whatever. Hopefully, you can still hear some of the sound effects in the background. I'll turn the music down and the master volume down slightly. I did put the sound effects all the way up. Yeah, hopefully you still got all that. Now, it looks like we've got some sort of stamina that we've got to watch out for in flying. Hopefully that's upgradable at some stage. Heading over this way then. I'm not really overly seeing it. Oh, it's that green bar for stamina. Okay, fair enough. I think that's where I got mullered, just down there. Whoop! There we go. Is there a run button? Tethering. Use LB while in range. Oh look, we've got a we've got a little Spider-Man claw thing. Nice. What the fudge are you, mate? Yeah, take that, jelly on. I'll tell you what, it doesn't take much to die. Okay. Alright. Let's uh, let's do some tethering. There we go. Boom. Oh that's cool. And I guess then you could like glide afterwards, yeah? Well, you could if you're as quick with the button presses, Steve. All right, cool. Yeah, maybe not. All right, okay, well, I, I need to head to my destination. We need to find this um, hammer claw or whatever. I'm not too sure where I'm looking for this hammer claw. I don't know where I'm supposed to be following. Oh, okay, it's back this way, apparently. Must have gone past it, doing all my stuffage. Let's, uh, let's get rid of that message anyway. 
think I've quite got the use to that. Right, Hammerclaw, where are you? I don't know what it looks like. It doesn't give you a picture of what a Hammerclaw looks like. Now what is it sending me over there for? Look, there, there we go. We've got the marker here. What am I looking for exactly? Ah, hold on. Sweet. Okay. And I guess we're following these these lines, right? Aha! Is that him over there? He looks a bit smaller than that other feathery creature that we uh, tangled with last time and I got completely millered. Yeah, look, he's, he's only got half energy. Oi, come here! Oh, I can tether onto the monster! Hiya! Take that, Hammerclaw! You're mine! We're going for a big hit. Pow! Okay. Now, the thing that makes Monster Hunter fun is the actual skills. You need skills to pull them off. This is... Once you get close, other than dodging, it seems very bashy. Okay. Oh, hold on. You can collect resources using a portal. Oh, okay. Oh, so you don't have to go all the way back to camp all the time. You can just grab... Oh, I like that. Stick that in there. How do I put it in? Teleport to... Okay. Oh, sweet! I think we've got everything from this guy now. I don't think I can get anything else. Can I go in there as well? No. Well, that sucks. I want to go in there. Close port... Teleport portal. Aha! There we go. You have to just hold it down. Oh, I like that. That's cool. And we're back at the village. Sweet. Okay, we'll get rid of that. Now let's go talk to this chappy. Yes, I killed a Hammerclaw, because I'm awesome. Hopefully those who do not believe you could be trained in time will take heed and maybe come back to the village. Nice, okay. We must take the first steps in fulfilling our promise. You must begin to return peace to the world. That's a heavy duty, isn't it? There's a new weapon for you by my workbench. It's heavy. But you still have the advantage, even though it's slow to wield. Okay. Shadows be with you, brave warrior. All right. Let's have a look. Okay, we're having that. We've got a giant freaking mallet, mate. How do I get? How do I go into it? Um, R trigger. There we go. Sweet. Equip A. I guess that's A. Anyway. Okay, that's A. All right, we got it. All right. Let's test that out. Oh, dear me. Honestly, I think I prefer the axe. Okay, let's have a look at that then. Hunt Ancients. Earn upgrade primitive armor. That's tracked, apparently. Collect sky vine. You need more sky vines. I have no idea where I've got to get sky vines from. Oh, here we go. Find and slay. Let's, uh, let's do that instead. That sounds like fun. But you know what? Although that I've got this big heavy hammer, I don't, I don't, I, I think I would prefer to have. Oh. How do I get into there then? Monsters, tribe, character, maybe? Yeah. And then go over here. I would rather have this one, please. Yeah, we'll go with that, even though it's, it's a, a bit of a, a shitier weapon. We're going to go with that. Right, so... Kill the Ancient Venom Crest. Wow, we've got quite a lot to hunt. Can I actually lock on to just one of these creatures at a time or something? Quest, hunt the Ancients. Alright, well we're just going to go exploring them, people, and see if we come across some of these creatures. We're just going to go murder stuff. There we go, let's do that. Lovely. I'm on my way. Heck yes. Oh, what's this? Is that is that something I can have? 
Can I have that? I don't know. Maybe it's a tether point or something. Yeah, it's a terror point. So we're in the plains. Plains creatures, where are you? I am here to stick an axe in your head. Creatures? Creatures! Behold, it is I, Captain of the Steves. Um, well, I'm not overly seeing much to slay. It'd be nice if there was some sort of mini-map, wouldn't there? Oh look, you can swap you can swap weapons on the fly. Oh, I thought I could swap weapons on the fly. I just swapped to the freaking axe. I mean the the hammer somehow. Oh, pow! Oh, he went all spiky. Pow! You get bag. Take that, you. All right, we got him. I didn't want to swap my freaking weapon. Oh, okay. yeah. I'll add that as a favourite and equip that then. Right, left, right. I'm looking for a map. I bet it's M on the keyboard or something, isn't it? No. All right, well, we haven't got one then. Aha! We've got a creature. Is he on my list of killing... A scale back. He's not, but he's going to have it. He's going to freaking have it. Right, there's not much that indicates the level that these creatures are. And you know what I was saying? I hope this game isn't another Dauntless. Right now, this game feels like another Dauntless. But with maybe some gliding thrown in for good measure. Pow! Oh dear. Uh-oh. I've made him angry. And I don't know how to heal myself. I think this guy's a couple of levels higher than me or something. Because I'm doing... I'm hitting him, but... You can see there... The damage that um, I've managed to do to him... Isn't all that great. Okay. I seem to have got him in a, in a point where he's... Not bothered about me. Oh no, that jelly just attacked me for freaking no reason. That jelly done quite a lot of damage. Dang it. I don't want to take on the two of them. Holy fudge, did you see that move that he just did? Alright, we're going to get rid of this jelly. Get out of it, jelly. Oh, I got my energy back. That was handy. Uh-oh, I think my axe is getting damaged. We're going to go to the hammer instead. All right, let's get him with this. This is a bit slower, though. Oh, oh, he's doing a move. Let's uh, let's tether onto him. Hey ah! Oh, I'm dead again. I would say this feels very floaty. And... It's not very intuitive where I can find these creatures. And considering this is early game, I'm perishing a lot. And how do I actually fix my weapons? Because they're obviously getting broken. Weapon smithing. All right. And I, of course, I've got no freaking, not enough resource to perform this task. So I can't fix anything because I haven't killed anything and I haven't given my resources. This is one of those, isn't it? One second, people. I think I need to tweak the audio again now because we've got no music at all. Alright, let's let's do this. All right, let's jump a little bit further this time. Let's go somewhere else. I like the world. I like everything that I'm looking at. It does look beautiful. It looks better than it plays. Now something that I'm noticing, I'm getting like these little bars. Is that V-Sync? Let me let me just go in. Let's have a quick look, see if I can fix that quickly. Options, graphics, graphics quality settings. Oh, it has to be done in the main menu. You know what? This is just a first impressions video. Is this a game that I want to continue to play? I must admit it looks nice and maybe I'm not giving it enough time. But right now, this, this feels a little bit floaty. It's early access. Hopefully they're going to tighten this up. Oh, there's a jelly on. Let's, um, 
now at least I can hear the music. Hopefully you guys can too. When you get hit, it doesn't feel like you've been hit either. There's no sort of feedback or anything like that. Right, so I'm following these lines right now, and I'm hoping they're going to lead me to another creature. So this is the creature I killed earlier. The sky whales everywhere. I mean, look at it. it. It is a beautiful game. Okay. But, you know, at the moment, I've got to hunt these creatures, and there's no indication where these creatures are. I'm not even seeing any sort of trail lines like I was previous, either. Maybe I'm missing something obvious, but I don't think I am. I love, I love the world. Take that, jelly on! Now, he's going to hit me, but I don't care, because when I kill it, I'm going to get all my energy back anyway. Because that's what they do. They give you all your energy back. And they're very pointless creatures. hi -ya! Oh, it's a razor wing. Oh, don't watch this. Oh, it's a hammer claw. He's got all of his energy, though. You see, I just got hit again, then. But it didn't feel like I got hit. I need to kill that jelly on, get my energy back before I die. And I'm not too sure how I lock on to something. Oh no, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Uh, uh, take that, you. I got my energy back. That was so freaking close. Right. I'm trying to carve this thing up. Let's put the portal there. Let's get some help. I don't know how to. There we go. Let's chuck that in there quickly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get in there. Th this blinking bumblebee is going to kill me. How do I get him? I'm tethered onto the dang thing. No, I don't know how to hit that. How am I, what am I supposed to do against flying creatures? Throw me a freaking bone. Oh my days. I'm going to get killed carrying this. Ah! Run! Oh, I died again. But it doesn't feel like you... It's just so floaty when you die and when you get hit. I have no idea how I'm supposed to hit that airborne creature. Oh, man. Alright, I've got three portals out. Can I go back through one of my portals? How do, how do portals work? Do I have to close them or something? What the fudge? Oh, okay. That does very little. I just walked through it, didn't I? Can I interact with this? No. Okay. Righto. Um, I think my weapons are getting broken. I don't think I'm being very successful in gaining resources. Am I having fun? Oh, I'm still playing it. But it's uh, a little bit dubious, to say the least. Okay. Now the reason I like the look of this is it looked a little bit like Towers of Azkabar, a game that I want to pick up in November. I just hope that Towers of Azkabar has got a bit more polish than this. Right, there's one of those red fire git bags down there. Is he the same as the other git bag that killed me earlier? Right, he's a scale back. I don't need to bother with a scale back. I'm going to run away. I'm running away because that's probably going to be too tough for me. And I've learnt my lesson now. I'm getting killed every five seconds. So, is he still freaking after me? He, he is. Budge. I want to just kill the creatures that I've been assigned to kill. But there's nothing on a map showing me where I've got to go or how I go about doing it. It shows me all the local tether points, but it's not really what I'm after. Hold on, look. We've got some lines going this way. Where's it taking me? 
Oh, it's taking me back to this guy. Which is not the guy that I want to fight. Okay, so I guess it's a case of trying to find those track lines for a creature that I do want to fight, isn't it? I have no idea on the size of these creatures, their habitats, nothing. Just their names. They need to give you a little bit more of a clue, I think, at this early part of game. Right, this is where I was hacking up these bad guys and then got murdered. Right. And I guess throwing all the parts that you've got into the portal, even if you die, renders it ineffective, I guess. I'm guessing. I don't know. I mean, I've had a couple of portals open now. I've sent the resources back, but I haven't even got enough resources to fix my wares. What about this? Is that going to give me wood? Yeah, it does give me wood. Okay, cool. Holy fudge. All right, well, let's, um, let's go take this and put that in the portal then. Oh my days. Just casually carrying a giant freaking log. Where was that flying git bag that murdered me? It's not here anyway. Which is good, because you freaking done me a number, didn't he? Can I put this inside of the teleporter? That'd be nice, wouldn't it? No, I can't after all that. Oh god, all right. Well, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with wood, then. Request processing. Cannot portal. All right. I have no idea how I process it. Yeah, this is this is very much like I'm in need of a tutorial. You know what I mean? This is, I know it's early access. Maybe they haven't put that in yet. But for a game that's cost me 25 quid, and I'm at the point where I'm like, oh, my days, I just spent 25 quid on this. Okay, so I can put down the portals wherever I want. And it's like I've got three of the dang things. All right, I can put them wherever I like. Well, there's that flying git bag that's just going to murder me because I can't hit flying git bags. And maybe I need a gun or something or a bow. But you can probably sense by my confusion... On how I mean how I'm gonna try that bird I'm gonna try the flying creature again there must be a way that I can hit this thing it doesn't come down low enough to, for me to hit it the tethering you go all the way around it but I can't get the height above it to come down and clout him so I guess onwards we go let's try and find another creature that I can actually attack hammerclaw well he's not on my list You'd think that the creatures on the list to kill would be in abundance, wouldn't you? But now I'm finding all the creatures that are really capable of murdering me. So we're now in a mushroom area. I would expect to find the venom crest here. Being all fungal. Oh, it's going to night time now as well. Get out of it, hammer claw. I'm not after a hammer claw. Now we've got some purple glow lines. I wonder if that's a mission creature. We've got green ones. I don't know what the colour coding is. Maybe it is purple because the title is purple. But the purple lines have vanished now. So have I gone past it? Oh, who knows? I'm just making this up as I go along. Because there is no tutorial. Each monster has claimed its own region of the map. Use what you have learned about them to make yourself stronger and exploit their weaknesses. What the fudge are you? Oh, great. He's an adult freaking flying git bag. Hold on. He's a storm tail, isn't he? Lock on. Lock on. I, I want the name to come up. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's one. He's one on my list. Oh, for fudge's sake. He can throw freaking tornadoes. And he's a freaking adult. I'm dead. Holy mackerel. Look at him go. And I, could, I, don't, I have no idea how I'm supposed to get up there. I mean, I can tether to him. I think. Yeah. 
I've tethered to him. Can I grab onto him? If I keep... I died. One hit kill. Yeah, I'm not even sure how you upgrade armor. Nothing. It's, um... I think this game could be good if they had some good programmers. That's, um... Pretty much it, to be honest. Hunt the adult storm tail. Yeah, well done. Upgrade primitive armor. I think that needs to happen because I'm dying too freaking quick. Cloth primitive. Oh, okay. Collect terror stone. Okay. Primitive spear. Right, maybe I need to do this first before I go hunting stuff. You need more sky vine. Resources is found winding its way up outside of tall rocky spires. What? Winding its way up tall rocky spires. Okay. Is it now showing me where to go? Is that is that where I'm going to find this tall rocky spire? Or does that lock me onto something else now? Let's have a look. Aha! There's a tall rocky spire. Let's go over there. Let's go get some sky vine. Whoa! Can I climb this? How do I grab? Aha! Here we go. Here's some. I got some. How much do I need? You need more bind sap. Well, what the fudge is bind sap? Okay, I guess it's pointing me to bind sap. Well, what's that green glowy stuff over there? Oh. I want to know what the green, green glowy stuff is. One second. Looks interesting, whatever it is. I'd have that. Yeah? I don't know. I don't know what that is then. It's nothing. Alright, let's go over here then. Let's go get the bind sap. This is where I get murdered by that creature down there though, isn't it? Wee! I do like the whistling effects. Here we go. Bind sap. Ah, do I do I have to kill a jelly on to get the bind sap? What are you pointing me at exactly? Oh, for fudge, he's gonna get me, soldier. Okay, let's kill a jelly on. Let's let's see if we get bind sap from the jelly on. I don't want to have to fight you, but you you're giving me no choice. I'm gonna die though. Look, my energy's like super low now. There's a green Glem Crawler in here as well. Maybe he gives me the bind sap. Oh, he's freaking hard as nails and all. Okay, I don't like this. Ah, there's bind sap. Right, let's just get the fudge out of here, shall we? Yeah, 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 yeah. Get me out of here. Oh, fudge sake, I'm dead again. I was trying to teleport back, but yeah. I don't know whether I get to keep my stuff or what. I've lost a load. Of, I've lost a load. I don't know. It just feels too floaty. And when you get hit, there's no knockback. There's no fall down. It, it doesn't feel like you're actually getting hit. The actual combat mechanics, when you hit stuff, is good. But when they hit you, it's it's like they haven't. It's, but they've obviously done a lot of damage. And honestly think, at the start of this game, it's too freaking hard. This this is harder than freaking Elden Ring. And I don't think it's hard. Okay, here you go. Let's um, teleport that back. That's one. I think I've got one. All right, where's another one of them things? Where are you, Bind Sap? It doesn't exactly stand out, does it? But what does is these freaking creatures, they're evil. Oh my god, I can't find any more of them things. They're the wrong freaking colour. Alright, well it's, it's pointing me to something else now anyway. So many, use, so many uh, distance that way. All right, we'll go over there then. Fun times. I think he's chasing me. I can hear him right behind me anyway. 
Well, I guess we're going to have to fly around this mountain then. Lovely. Jesus Christ. All right. Infinite stamina for gliding might be a, a bit of a thing. You know, that'd be nice. Want to be able to glide for longer. Let's head on up here. Let's see what was up here then. Moondrop Pearl now. Okay, so I guess I've got all the, the sap that I needed. All right. Search for Moondrop Pearls in the ruin. Okay. There's a gle gleam crawler in here. You a Moondrop Pearl when you're at home, mate? Yeah. We got him. Okay. Let's go back to the village and let's let's get that crafted then, shall we? Right, eh? Yeah, do that. Let's do that one. You task. Right. I need some more sky vine and I need another moon drop pearl. All right. If I... Alright. So we've got that going. Upgrade primitive armour. And that's going to take another... What? How, how long is that going to take? It's going to take an hour to craft the armour. Oh, I don't like time gates. Especially when you've got creatures that are freaking doing you a number in a matter of seconds. Hmm. Okay. This doesn't feel good, does it? All right, well, I want to craft another piece of armor, but it's pointing me back there for that mission. I want to go get some more moon pearls and stuff like that. I mean, I know where to roughly find them now, but I'm never going to find myself my way back to that. That freaking place where the moon drop pearls was. I mean, yeah, the sky vine. Fine. I, I kind of get the gist of where I'm going to find sky vine. The sky vine's just on the top of these columns, isn't it? Hopefully moon drop pearls are found in ruins all the time. Be nice to have two bits of armour on the bake, wouldn't it? Oh, fudge! I'll tell you what. It's it's not easy controlling that glider. Alright, well, we've got some more Skyforge stuffage anyway. I think I need one more anyhow. We'll grab that one too then. So I need to find another ruin. This looks like a ruin. Right, I've got to find my way into this place to get myself another one of those moon things. Not overly seeing. Oh, there we go. There's another one of those. We'll have that anyway. I mean, this looks like a ruin, doesn't it? Can I grapple onto that all the way up there? I'm not very good at grappling. The cameras feel wonky as well, though. Okay. So, oh, here we go. We've got another one of them. Yep. Lovely. Any more for any more? What about over there? In here? Oh, I would have expected one to be in there, to be honest, but it's not. Right. Go on, get up there. Any more for any more? There's not. All right, so that stuff's quite... I wonder if I've got enough. Let's go back. Yeah. Okay. This isn't quite Monster Hunter, and I actually think Dauntless probably plays a little bit better for now than this. This just feels a little bit too floaty. Okay, so if I go into here... I'm, am I already doing that one? Which one did I freaking do? Primitive Upper Armour. There we go, we can do this one. Right, so we'll stick that one in there as well. Hold on, it's saying that it's only going to take another 12 seconds now. Alright. Alright, fine. We've got those on the bake then. 
That's it. I honestly don't know what I'm waiting for. It still says one hour over there, time remaining. I don't know whether that's one hour in-game time or, or what. All right, anyway, quests. Let's see what else we can do then. Um, craft primitive cleave saw. Let's track that one then. Hmm. What's going on? It's not my control pad just decided it's not going to respond. I'll try plugging it in back in again. Come on. All right, here we go. Track. Collect terror stone. All right. All right. At least it's pointing me to Terra Stone now, so we go get that one. So I guess I need to upgrade all my weapons before I go engaging in shenanigans, which means that this could be rather grindy. But does it feel worth the grind? Well, the combat feels quite. Oh, what's going on here? Why has it gone into a loading screen? What's going on? This is a bit weird. Has the game crashed? Am I getting a cutscene? Oh, okay. Oh, right, when when nine goes, okay. Petrock went hungry. I didn't know I had to feed. What the? F hey, I don't. I don't know how to. Oh my god. I I don't see anywhere where I'm supposed to be feeding. I don't see a hunger bar. All right, this is weird. Anyway, we're heading towards the Terra Stone. That was a bit abrupt, wasn't it? I didn't know that it was going to... Ah, there's a timer in the top there. You see where it says time of day? We're now on day two. Looks like my armour is finished. Oh, great. Now it's pointing me back up to camp. So it just swapped my... All right, okay. Let's go back to camp before I get murdered. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I want to go back to the freaking... Right, I'm getting battered again then. Aha! Well, that's that's one way to get back to camp. All right, we learned something new today. All right, let's see if we can get our armors then. Oh, Hello. What are you... Hey, what the... Huh? What? I just crafted new armour, didn't I? Well, where is it then? Oh, primitive armour polished. Okay, well, where's the other part that I got? I've done two parts. And it doesn't look any different. Oh, it's just my old armour, but I've polished it somehow. I don't know. I honestly don't know. It It's not that great. You can make improvements, but you'd need better tools. Yeah, all right. Yeah. Hey, I don't feel this feel... I don't think this feels worth it. It looks nice. This game looks nice. It just doesn't play nice. Okay, build. All right. And I can build a bed now, can I? And that's going to cost me Skyvine, which is the same stuff that I use to upgrade stuff. And then it's given me this, but I... it's overlapping other objects. Can I put it there then? Oh, there we go. I've built a bed. Uh, why go to sleep? Oh, oh, my days. No, get out. I'm wasting my day. All right, well, that's fun. So build, I can build now. The only thing I can build is a bed. Well, that's done. So, we've done that. There you go. Tutorial done. Is this... Is this being done or something? Oh, no. Now I need to get more Moondrop Pearls to take it up from being polished to being to treated. But they look the same. We're just going from polished to treated. And it isn't... It's... it's telling me that it's going to be like level five and the defense goes up from seven to twelve i don't know whether it's worth it you know i much preferred power world to this 
Power World is much, much more fun. And I prefer Dauntless when it comes to the creature attacking. I like I like this world. I love the graphical art style. That's all this has got going for it. That is all this has got going for it. So there we go, people. I think I know enough now to make my first impressions of this game. Is it worth 25 quid? No, because I already don't want to play it anymore. Um, I think this needs a heck of a lot more polish, a lot more updates. It's one that's going to stay in my library, and every time it's updated, I'm going to jump back in, and I'm going to give it a go and see if it's improved. But right now, this feels a very basic bones. This is a very, very early access. At least I hope it is. If they're hoping that people are going to pick up and enjoy this, they're, they're wrong. It looks nice. It looks like I'd enjoy. It ticks all the freaking right boxes. The tutorial is naff. It's pretty much non-existent. The creatures that you can... Tr There's no tracking for them. There's no creature dossier from what I can see in here. Oh, hold on. There's a tutorial. T oh, here we go. All right. It would have been nice if they pointed this out, wouldn't it? So there's a storm tail. And all these are undiscovered. So I've still got to go around and try and discover them before I can find them. All right. So you've got tactics as well. It actually told... Oh, okay. This is better. I didn't spot all this before. It'd be nice if this was in... Here we go. Here's some tutorials as well. Okay, so use your axe on trees. Fair enough. How do you process the wood, though? To harvest, process large logs. Build a lumber mill. All right, I'm finding everything now after I've complained about it. Beast harvesting. Yep, yeah, we kind of did that. And you use your hammer on mining elements. Right. It didn't tell me that when I made the hammer, though. It just said, oh, it's quite a slow weapon. It didn't say use it on minerals, did it? Okay, cool. Look at that. There's a lot that you can harvest and things that you carry. All right. And then that goes towards building better things. All right. Okay. Okay. You need to make this tutorial more freaking obvious, people. Okay, we've got a map as well. So I've already been to the Mushroom Forest. That's where I found one of the creatures. But look, there's no way to add like a... Not that I can see anyway. There's no way to add like a, a waypoint. Go there. All right, well, now that I've found the tutorial, now that I've found the monsters page, maybe I need to explore each area of the map and, un and get it so I can discover these creatures. All right. Well, maybe I was about to write this game off before I should, people. Maybe I need to go and discover some of this. But look, there's, there's no freaking compass. So I don't know where the south is or the north. Hmm. Does it actually show me on the map as well? Let's have a look. Map, 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 map. Does it say you are here? No, it doesn't even give you your marker on the map. Well, maybe it's not giving me my marker because I'm too close to base. Let, let's set off on another adventure. Let's go somewhere else. We're going to explore one more area of the map, people. And we're going to see if we can find anything interesting. Let's go over this way. Zoom. Let's head over to that tower there that's got like a telescope built into the top of it. Hopefully we can make it there. Right, well I've got a little bit better at gliding. We've got a hammer claw there. What's this then? Alright. Getting up the top there is going to be fun, isn't it? I'm really not good at this tethering stuff. And the camera angles aren't helping, to be fair. The fact that every single creature is aggressive before you've even attacked it is a little bit of a bind. Anyway, let's head this way. We're going to another area of the map that I haven't been to, so... Let's go this way. We want to discover more creatures. Ideally, anyway. The Northern Forest. Alright, so this is definitely not south. But have I been to the Northern Forest? I'm not 100% sure. 
So that's another thing. It doesn't show you which parts of the maps you've already been to. Let's just have a look at the map now. So if I'm in the Northern Forest, I can head to the Great Lakes and the Water Temple. Perhaps. Let's have a look around here, though. Let's see if there's a creature that I haven't killed located here. There's Hammer Claws. Yep, I'm not bothered about Hammer Claws. Thank you. Any other creatures around here? Aha, this must be the Great Lake. And now I know I can smash these. Uh-oh, I'm getting completely mullered, though. Run! Run like the wind! You're getting battered. By one of those flying devils that I don't know how to kill. Because I don't know how to take out airborne creatures. I'm imagining I'm going to need maybe the spear. Can't be sure, though. A hammer claw down here. Jelly on. Okay, we've got some green lines pointing me that way. These, these are pointing me through this rock face. Let's head up, up, up there then. Eastern Spire. Okay. Getting a little bit better at grappling, but I wouldn't say I'm au fait with it. Mind is stretch of the imagination. And there's no climb button. But I saw people scaling monsters and all sorts of stuff. It's not the easiest of world to, to, to traverse. Unless I'm just rubbish, which is possible. Not seeing many other creatures right now. But that's the fun of it, isn't it? Is locating these creatures to do battle with. That's another scale back. There's lots of scale backs and they're easy to spot. Can I can, can I go in water? Can I swim? That's something worth trying, isn't it? Let's see if we can swim. Out of bounds, nope. Okay, I'm back in bounds. You can't swim. We've learned that. You can see there, these, these arrows are pointing me through there. There's a scale back stuck on the mountain over there. Oh, we've got a new creature. Oh, no, we haven't. It's a feather hide. The feather hides kicked my hide last time, didn't they? They completely annihilated me. And the trouble is, is on the map, there's no marker to indicate where you are. So I don't know if I'm getting close to the water temple or what. And that is just really fiddly. I mean, I would like to climb this, but... You'd think there'd be one grapple point to the next grapple point, but you're sort I'm sorely wrong. I mean, look at this. How do we get up there? It obviously takes skill that I don't got. I mean, climb, jump, dang you. Okay. Damn it, press the wrong button. No. I don't think we're having much luck because the map isn't all that useful. I'll tell you what, the music does you nothing after a little while, people. It'd be nice if each zone had different music as well. Yeah, you know what? I just think this game needs a heck of a lot more development. I don't think it should be out there in early access right now. I mean, the developers, I think you should be very proud with what you've managed to accomplish thus far. I mean, I don't know how many people are working on this. I don't know whether this is your first game or what. But you've got the basics of a good game. You've got something. This has got promise. This has got promise. But right now, that promise is... It falls very far short of being a game. I think you've got a bit of a cheek charging 25 quid for this right now. I found a person. Okay.
Die, jelly on! Yeah! Get my health back, nice. Alright, well there we go, people. That's that's Ferra. And at the moment, Ferra looks nice, doesn't play all that nice. It's a bit it's a bit janky, and it hasn't quite got all the game mechanics to make this feel like a fun game. Or at least it hasn't to me. I bet if you're the developer and you know what you're doing, this is great fun. But right now, not so much. Bye, people. Take care. Salute to Monday. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again.